This is me in the June of 2015 during my sophomore year internship working on a stereo lithography based 3D printer. I was a part of a small startup, three person team actually, and we were trying to build a commercial UV DLP printer. That's ultraviolet direct light processing. Basically, we cure a photochemical resin by shining a light of certain wavelength on it and harden it layer by layer. Anyway, if you want to know more about my experience, I have a whole blog post up on my tech blog. That's not what this video is about. After this internship, my experience with 3D printers had been minimal. Although I did serve as a TA for digital fabrication in my junior year, we were not allowed to fully experiment with the college 3D printers, and I didn't have resources to buy one on my own at the time. Fast forward seven years, and I finally bought my own 3D printer. It's a Creality Ender 3. 3D printer based on FDM techniques that fuse deposition modeling where we deposit the molten filament layer by layer. I am using a polylactic acid based filament which is pretty good for its strength and durability. I have not used it a whole lot so far but I did print some interesting designs. I will show some of my creations in the later videos. This video is about me assembling this 3D printer which took me about 5-6 hours. The instruction sheet given with this printer is not quite beginner friendly so I followed this awesome YouTube tutorial from 3D Printing Canada. I was being cautious all the way as I didn't want to mess up in between and then painfully retrace my mistake after garbage prints. Fortunately, my patience paid well and all my prints so far have come out fantastic. I had my Canon M50 Mark II mirrorless camera and my phone so I could shoot from different angles. It was as much important for my own analysis if I did any mistake as much as it was for this video. So I made a makeshift contraption, hooked up my phone at weird places, put my camera on the mini tripod and tried to document the entire build process. Here is me assembling my new Creality Ender 3 3D printer. Enjoy. It's the crown on the beat, nigga. There is one small mistake in this video about using the wrong size Z axis screw which I had rectified on my own before scrolling through the comments and seeing quite a few people have already pointed that out. Since the components are numbered and not many spares have been provided, it is important to take care of these small nuances.
One thing that I didn't mention in this video is that I used Ultimaker Cura for slicing the model. Well, the test model of Maneki Neko Cat came in pre-sliced in the SD card, but for the later prints, I have been using Ultimaker Cura, which is super intuitive with tons of options. Anyway, I really enjoyed this assembly process, and it was such a relief when the first print came out great. Honestly, I couldn't take my eyes off for those seven hours. Hope you enjoyed this video. This is not a tutorial by any means. I just wanted to document the building process with the footage I had in my own style. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Ciao.